Tiny Wonders Introducing Crayfish Hatchlings Crayfish hatchlings are fascinating creatures, tiny, delicate, and full of potential. These miniature versions of adult crayfish are crucial for the continuation of their species. From the moment they hatch, these tiny creatures display incredible resilience and adaptability. Crayfish hatchlings, also known as larvae, start their lives clinging to their mother's abdomen for essential protection. As they grow, they undergo a series of molts, shedding their exoskeletons to accommodate their increasing size. Understanding the needs of crayfish hatchlings is essential for successful breeding programs. By providing the right environment and care, we can help ensure the survival of these fascinating creatures. Their successful development contributes to the ecological balance of their habitats. Every stage of their development, from hatching to reaching adulthood, is a testament to the power of adaptation and survival in the animal kingdom. Out of the egg the hatching process. The hatching process of crayfish is a remarkable sight. After weeks of carrying the eggs, the mother crayfish finds a secure and secluded location. The eggs, which have been meticulously cared for, begin to hatch almost simultaneously. Tiny, translucent crayfish emerge, clinging to their mother's swimmerettes. These hatchlings, though small, are perfectly formed with all the features of adult crayfish. For the first few days of their lives, they rely heavily on their mother's protection. As the hatchlings grow, they will venture away from their mother for short periods, seeking food and exploring their surroundings. However, they remain close to their mother, returning to the safety of her abdomen when threatened. Understanding this delicate stage is essential for anyone looking to breed and raise these captivating creatures. A safe haven, the rearing tank. Creating a safe and suitable rearing tank is crucial for the survival of crayfish hatchlings. A spacious tank with a large surface area is ideal, allowing for adequate oxygen exchange. The tank bottom should be covered with a layer of fine sand or gravel, providing a natural substrate for the hatchlings to burrow and explore. Live plants, such as java moss or hornwort, improve water quality and offer hiding places for the hatchlings. Rocks, caves and PVC pipes can be added to create additional shelter and mimic their natural environment. It's essential to maintain a separate rearing tank for hatchlings, away from adult crayfish, which can pose a significant threat. Regular water changes are vital to keep the rearing tank clean and free from harmful toxins. A water temperature between 70 and 75 degrees Fahrenheit and a pH of 6.5 to 7.5 are optimal for their growth and development. A gentle filtration system, such as a sponge filter, helps maintain water quality without posing a threat to the small hatchlings. Section 4. Hide and Seek, Creating Safe Spaces In their natural habitat, crayfish hatchlings are masters of camouflage and seek refuge in crevices, under rocks, and amidst vegetation. Replicating these hiding spots in the rearing tank is essential for their well-being and survival. These safe spaces offer protection from predators and reduce stress. Rocks can be arranged to form caves and tunnels, while PVC pipes cut to different lengths provide additional hiding spaces. Live plants, especially those that grow densely, offer excellent cover and mimic their natural environment. The key is to provide a diverse range of hiding options, catering to the hatchling's natural instincts. Creating a stimulating and enriching environment with ample hiding spots promotes their well-being and encourages natural behaviors. It allows them to exhibit their innate instincts, contributing to their overall health and development. Section 5. Hungry Little Critters Feeding Hatchlings Crayfish hatchlings have a voracious appetite and require frequent feeding to support their rapid growth. They are omnivorous, consuming both plant and animal matter. A varied diet is essential for their health and development, ensuring they receive all the necessary nutrients. In their early stages, hatchlings benefit from a diet rich in protein, such as newly hatched brine shrimp, daphnia, and microworms. As they grow, their diet can be expanded to include crushed flake food, blanched spinach, and small pieces of bloodworms. Feeding should be done several times a day, offering small amounts of food at a time. Overfeeding can lead to water quality issues, so it's crucial to remove any uneaten food within a few hours. Providing a balanced and nutritious diet is crucial for the healthy development of crayfish hatchlings. Section 6. Crystal Clear Maintaining Water Quality Maintaining pristine water quality is paramount for the health and survival of crayfish hatchlings. 
These delicate creatures are highly susceptible to changes in water parameters, and even slight fluctuations can have detrimental effects. Regular monitoring and maintenance are crucial for their well-being. Ammonia and nitrite, byproducts of fish waste, are highly toxic to crayfish hatchlings. Regular water changes, at least 25% weekly, are essential for removing these harmful substances. A reliable water testing kit is indispensable for monitoring ammonia, nitrite, and nitrate levels. The pH of the water should be kept within a range of 6.5 to 7.5. By regularly monitoring and maintaining water parameters, we can ensure a healthy and thriving environment for these fascinating creatures.